In this video, I'm going to touch on alerts that can be configured for harsh braking, harsh acceleration, and harsh turning. And I'll explain in depth how to use our accelerometer report to monitor driver behavior. The purpose of the accelerometer report is to provide driver behavior information specifically concerning harsh turning, braking, and accelerating. It helps you ensure that your drivers are driving safer and your vehicles are handled with more care, resulting in less mechanical issues. There is an added cost to this feature. Ask your Track Your Truck representative what that cost is. Okay, let's get started. Log into your interface. If you want to set up alerts and are not sure how to do so, refer to our alerts configuration video. For the purpose of this video, I am merely going to show you where these driver behavior alerts are. Okay, once you're logged in, click on Options. Click on Alerts. Click on Add New. Under Available Alerts, click on When Status Is. Immediately you will see Harsh Acceleration, Harsh Deceleration 1, 2, and 3 with three being the worst case scenario where your driver likely was in an accident or hit something and stopped abruptly. And finally, harsh left and right turns. So you can set up alerts based on these specific events. Next, I'll demonstrate how to use the report associated with these driver behavior variables. Assuming you're already logged in, click on reports. Click on accelerometer report. Next, select the truck or trucks of interest. You can select one truck, several trucks, or all the trucks if you so desire. For this exercise, I'm going to select multiple trucks so you can see how our system deals with multiple trucks. Next, select the dates and time frame for the period of time you want to review. I'm going to take it back to August 1st using the default of 24 hours each day so we have some good data. Next, select the event type. I will select harsh braking since that has the three levels of severity and it gives us a better example to view how this report works. Click on run report. The report opens and you will graphically see the number of violations and the severity of the braking. Now, MGs stand for millijes or one one thousandth of a unit of gravity. Gravity is a force exerted on an object when it is dropped at some distance above the ground. Let's give some common sense examples. A typical family sedan will rarely exceed 400 mg's when braking or cornering in the most severe cases. A high performance sports car on a racetrack will rarely get above 900 mg's when braking or cornering. For acceleration, 1,000 mg's would correspond to a 0 to 60 time of 2.8 seconds. So for our purposes, we will be flagging activity that is in the range of 250 to 500 mg's. Looking at the graph, you can see the vehicle name, number of violations of that vehicle, and the severity of those violations. Generally, you can tell the severity of the braking by the color of the graph. Blue is the least severe, 300 to 399 mg's. Yellow depicts middle range severity from 400 to 499 mg's. And let's hope you don't see very many reds because red is highly severe stopping, likely resulting from an accident. And that measures 500 to 599 mg's. Just like all of our other reports, you can export your findings to PDF, Excel, or Word format by selecting the desired format and clicking export. And that's how our accelerometer report works. Thanks.